Hi, my name is Lauren Phillips, and we're here shooting for Kiru and my signature Feel Stroker. What excites me most about being a Feel Star is knowing that my stroker is going to be out there and all the guys get to use it and stroke their dicks with my pussy. I think that's like the best thought in the world. Well, first, I just love my work. I love my job. It gives me so much pleasure. I also love being on set, being with the crew and being able to have sex on camera. And then my ultimate favorite thing is it like my video being out on the internet and people like jerking off to me. I'm such an exhibitionist. I just love it so much. Passion has a lot of meaning to me, actually. Being from New Jersey, I feel like passion is kind of defined as wanting, like wanting to the point that you have to have it. It's one of the things I like about like having sex is that when there's passion, you like want it and you grab at it because you have to have it. I think I would like to ask for a 10 guy gangbang. <laughs> I have to say that sometimes just being home and chilling in my sweatpants with some chocolate and the TV on was like either a movie or a good TV show. It's like the best. I feel what empowers me the most is actually my surroundings. I feel having people that motivate me and kind of give me that energy and inspires me. It's like very empowering and very motivating. It's just, I think that's why I make my surroundings with the people that I love the most. I'm mostly inspired by like, you know, stuff on the internet. I really look up to like veterans the most because I was always taught like, if you want something, you wanna surround yourself with it. So I love looking at people that have been in this industry a lot longer than I have and kind of envision what, I, what they have for me. Oh, what do I love to do? Well, when I'm not like on set and working, basically, I love God, doing like wine tastings. I love going to the movies. And I really love being able to like have the time to like hang out with friends and family. So I feel like that's what's really important. And with nowadays, I feel, I feel like we forget that part. I feel like the most important skill to have in bed is communication. Because <laughs> I feel like uh, with how we're raised and uh, society kind of has, we're afraid to communicate with what we feel and what we want to want or maybe try. So having communication and knowing that it's a safe space, it was really important. I feel like what makes Lauren Phillips unique and what makes me Lauren Phillips is obviously my look, which is being a ginger and curvy and tall, almost like a sexy Jessica Rabbit. But I feel like my personality really stands out and that you can see how genuine I am. I feel I like to bring the rawness into like what I'm doing so that people know that I'm a real person. Well, uh, during the lockdown, it was actually a little, like it was hard for me because like I said before, I love being on set. It's my first love and being around like my friends and the crew and the whole process is like my first love. So when I was, uh, during the lockdown, I was basically uh, working on my like business and trying to find how to achieve my goals that I still had for that year. 
in a different way and like maybe work on my passive income or like camming a lot more or just kind of reanalyzing because I feel like we can still make our goals even though there's an obstacle. My favorite position is missionary with my feet pinned behind my head. It's nice. What I enjoy the most about like interacting with my fans is actually getting to know them, giving them that safe space that their fantasy, whatever it is, is completely normal and really getting in touch with them. Cause I feel like sometimes we don't have that non-judgment zone, you know, like a comfort zone. And I like to give that to them because there is no judgment here. I accept them for who they are. Uh, something I actually would love to try in my career which still has not been done yet and i don't know why as i actually have not done a blow bang yet like an actual just blow bang i've done everything else except for that my advice is to like keep with like keep an open mind and kind of see what you like and there's a lot of stuff out there so you'll be able to find like your fetish niche. Yeah. My best advice to you is to really think about it. This is a business. And once it's out on the internet, it's out there forever. It can change your life and it becomes almost like a lifestyle. So really make sure that you're ready for that change. Respectful, professional, and kind of a freak. So the idea for the photo shoot today and uh, was basically on my personality and also how I feel my look is, uh, which is Hollywood glam. I'm, I like the vintage classic look. It's one of my favorites. Also, I have a huge, like, I feel, pinup type look where I'm very curvy, uh, nice big brown eyes. And I really feel like I chose that to really bring out the specific, I don't know, like looks that I have in myself. And I also, I think the like all American I got from really dipping into my personality and the Dom is also my personality as well. So uh, having being obviously from New Jersey, I had to, I you know, love my state and I love my country and I bring out my Jersey side when I dominate. I feel so excited to have this signature feel sugar out there and I think my fans are gonna love it and really get to connect to me with me more. I am ecstatic to be like, I can't wait to make videos and tell them how to use it and maybe like cam with it. Like I have so many ideas of how I want them to incorporate and have this part of their lives. 